Hi, this is James. Uh, this time I'm going to try and help someone at Learn Gospel Music who's looking for uh, the bass tab for Center of My Joy. Now, I'm not sure uh, which version he's talking about or which artist. It's recorded by a number of artists. So what I'll do is instead of writing a tab, I'll just kind of walk through uh, the way that I play the version that was recorded by um, Straight Gate Mass Choir. Um, it's in E flat, so I use an E string. I use a five string bass and um, it's normal tuning, so it's B, E, A, D, G, just normal tuning for a five string. Um, I, I put my middle finger at the root note, which is on the fourth fret of the, of the B string. That's my E flat. It's the root note. A uh, couple things about this song. Um, it, you need, just need to know the E flat scale, so E flat, F, G, a flat, B flat, C, D, E flat. So just walk the E scale, the E flat scale, a couple times to get familiar with the notes. Um, there's a few times in the song where it does kind of a cycle of fifths, uh, excuse me, a cycle of fourths. So you might go from uh, the one, which is an E flat. To the four, which is the A flat, and then to the um, it'll be a flat seven, um, which is the D flat. There'll be another time where you'll go from the F to which is your two to a um, B flat, which is your five, and then to an E flat, which is your octave. Or your eighth. So, um, you know, watch for those. You'll see a couple cycles of fourths played. You'll also see uh, the six, three, one, two pattern played a lot. So your six is going to be your C, and your three is going to be your G. Your one is always your root note, so that's the E flat. And then the two is your F. And the way that sounds when you put uh, those four notes together is, uh, you, you'll hear that a lot in the song, so get used to playing that. Six, three, one, two. Now the way I play the chorus, um, again, start with the root note. Sometimes I throw in an octave. Then I go to the three, that's a G on the E string, then to a B flat, and then an E flat, and then to the A flat. Then we go back to the, um, to the G. Now here's that six, three, two pattern. Then we go to um, the fifth note, which is your um, B flat. Then to the E flat. Now we start doing that cycles of fourth. So we're at A flat. Now we're at D flat. Go to a B to kind of turn us around. Then we go to um, B flat. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, B flat. C F B flat E flat. Let me do that again. You go B flat C. that last E flat you can do the low E flat like I did there or you can do the octave and get the higher tone and that would be a cycles of fourth so that's pretty much it for the chorus uh, for the verses they're slightly different um, again you start with the root note the E flat then you go to the three, 
and then go to the four and then back to the three. Now we do that six, three, one, two again. So again, those notes are C, G, E flat, F. Then we follow that with the three, four, five pattern. And those notes are G, A flat, B flat. And then you pretty much just go back to the chorus. Go to the B to turn it around. Cycle of fourths. That's the song. Try it. <laughs>